the description of Atlantis, of having that opening to the south, and then you see this clear pathway to the south. Yep. Everything lines up. The shape of Atlantis, like the, the concentric circles, the amount of them, earth to water, the way it, the, the representation of it as described, right. the mountains to the north, like everything lines up. Did you go yeah, there sure. personally? No. So I have, in fact, let me give them a shout out. Josh Sigurdsson. And David Sk uh, Stig Hansen went there individually. These are some intrepid fellows. It is a gutsy trip. Josh almost died because you have to drive through a minefield to go there. He <gasps> saw actual skeletons. And like an AK pointed at his head. Yeah. And like, it's it's really? a wild ass place. Yeah. He's, you have to drive through a fucking minefield yeah, to get there? Yeah, he had balls of steel. That <laughs> yeah, he's an intrepid fellow. Same yeah. with David. And to be honest, like, I don't, I'm t look, I don't, I'd rather fly over it. If someone wants to fly me over it, I'd love to get <laughs> some helicopter? great pictures. Yeah. Yeah. What if they shoot at the helicopter? <laughs> And that's Fuck another thing. That. I don't want to trash Mortania because I've heard from people who have gone there. They met the nicest people they've ever met in their lives. As long as they're not shooting you, they're nice. Yeah. But it's worth mentioning that, that I know. <laughs> well, there's all the gold there, too. I would imagine they would want to protect that gold. Which is why they won't let you do ground radar here. So Josh brought out mm. ground radar equipment, and they threatened imprisonment. And apparently, oh, this is one of yeah. those countries where they will cut off your fingers if you get caught stealing, potentially. And this is a country that it wasn't until the 80s. Uh, and uh, as well as additional law uh, legislature in like 2007 where to abolish slavery, but apparently it's not being enforced. Oh, so there are geez. still slaves in Mauritania. So I'm like, when I hear details like this, it makes me just not feel like driving out there. Here I am in beautiful, beautiful Mauritania. Obviously, this looks to be the most incredibly uniform candidate for the site of Plato's Atlantis. 